Hi Erin, today is Wednesday, October 5th, and for today's video, I am going to do Alex Day's YouTube survey. Okay, my first kiss was when I was 18, and it was with this boy named Tim, who has a really good singing voice. Um, I guess, I guess it was nice. It was alright. Amusing results from that included, um, kind of like a lot of people in musical and chorus and marching band and German class found out, and so they all kind of teased me a lot about it, I assume good naturedly, um, including my chorus teacher who pointed me out as the prime example of a hysterical fangirl during Bye Bye Birdie rehearsals, and my German teacher who taught us that commission is the German word for snogging. Um, so thanks to that guy. Okay, I might be bending the definition of casual clothing, but I didn't rule out pants, costumes, and formal gowns, so that's something. Um, so, four things. One, uh, jacket is two. Um, my favorite part is the buckles on the back. So I never actually wear it because I don't like how wide the shoulders are and then I'm all hourglassy. Look. Um, three are my river boots. I don't know if you can see how dirty they are but I do actually wear them as my snow boots during the winter. And four are my glasses. It is really weird to wear contacts and glasses at the same time. I can't see anything. I'm not sure what the first job I wanted was when I was little. I think probably that I wanted to be a dancer um, or some sort of performer entertainer, which is all still true, but with much less hope now. I am not sure about other things. I think I wanted to be a vet for a while. My group of school friends in middle school was very small. Uh, my current roommate was one of the people that I was friends with. In high school, my group of school friends was pretty much people who were on drill team slash color guard or in marching band and people who were in chorus and people who were in German class. My circle of friends in college was pretty much Kat and Seba and Vadia. And my group of school friends in library school was super duper awesome and I love them all and I miss being in library school with all of them. And Erin, you're part of that circle. Well, I mean, you're a library school friend, although you weren't part of like the school library friend circle, but you know what I mean. You're all my library friends. When I was little, I wanted to have lots of kids, um, which is not true anymore. There was a while when I wanted to name my kids after the days of the week, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, just like in Heckity Peg. And I'm pretty sure I wanted to have a daughter named December, which I kind of want to be named December. I think it'd go by date for short. Um, I actually never want to name a child Timothy because that's my name. And I'm so upset that it's not my name. So people have actually asked me that because I'm so attached to the name. But no, it's not allowed to be my child's name because it's mine. I wanted to name kids after Cabbage Patch Kids. I was initially supposed to be Rachel Marie and they were going to call me Rainy, like the girl in Cabbage Patch Dreams. And Rainy got trapped in an old gold mine with Sybil Sadie, so there was a while when I wanted to have kids named Rachel Marie and Sybil Sadie, and then I would probably force them to sing together about being stuck in an old gold mine. Because they were kidnapped by Cabbage Jack, forced to dig for gold by Lavender McDade. Erin, I'd like to know your answers to at least some of these questions. I will see you on Monday.